you guys yes oh wow it's a dog um so i was telling somebody this story um i know i don't know if some of you may not know the story of my film i made it by myself in my apartment um and that's that's kind of how i've had to do things um because of where i am and where i live and um i sometimes lose a lot of faith in what i'm doing um and so you know i I, I try to keep going, you know, and make the films like we all do, right? Um, but uh, this film in particular has been pretty difficult. It's it's very polarizing. It's, you know, I'm not saying things that everybody wants to hear. Um, and uh, I made it on a, on a big risk, I suppose, in some ways. But uh, it wasn't getting into festivals, and I kind of expected that to a degree. And then it got into slam dance, and I was like, wow, that's really amazing. And, um, and then I started meeting people from slam dance, and I thought, wow, these people are really cool. Like, wow, I want to be friends with like all of you, really, like really, I mean, seriously. And then, um, you know, I had this moment where I was like, remember, I was talking to you about this, remember when, v, uh, when MTV had music videos, and uh, you would watch music videos <laughs> on MTV? This is like in 94. <laughs> Some of you hadn't been born yet. Um, but I would come home from high school every day and I would turn that on. And there was this one music video and it was by Blind Melon and it was for No Rain. And, um, and it's about this girl who's kind of a freak. And she wears a bee costume and she wants to tap dance and dance for people and, and she gets made fun of and, and she doesn't have any friends. And then one day she stumbles upon a field of motherfucking bee people. <laughs> and they're dancing and they're like, come dance with me. And, that's how I feel about you, Slam Dance. Thank you for being my motherfucking bee people. <laughs>